Hey guys, so uh, this is where we left off from last time. Um, amongst trying to get my head around the new 6th edition rules, uh, I've been doing these guys on the side just as a practice, practice piece. Um, so yeah, this is how they turned out. So Savage Orc War Boys. Just a close look at how I did the bases. So first up, um, just really using your traditional cork type of base and then mixing sand and PVA. After that, uh, just spray paint the whole thing black. Make sure you get underneath as well and all the little gaps. Then once you've done that, just uh, building up with dry brush layers, going from Codex Grey to Fortress Grey and Skull White if you wish. Then using the new secret weapon pigments, um, I this was Dark Earth. I put them on and then sealed them in place with alcohol. And there they are as the finished result. So the snow is the crushed glass and then I've also done baking soda as well. And there they are in all their glory. Um, anyone who's seen the Savage Orc Boar Boys kit, um, they're a really dynamic kit and they're just full of options of different weapon loadouts, different poses, all that type of stuff. Uh, so what I did on these ones was um, just had a practice at painting animals and uh, also just kind of tested myself at airbrushing the skin. So all of the orc skin has been airbrushed building up consecutively with layers of green. They aren't quite as bright as they are in the photos but I was just trying to get the lighting right. All of the weapons as well um, are painted to look like stone rather than metal, just because I kind of figure that's the savage style. This guy is a lot of fun to paint. Um, he's full of options for brightness, uh, and he is the banner carrier as well. So he's a really tall model. This guy here was probably one of my favourites. Um, as you can see, the missing eye on the boar, I felt kind of needed some blood coming out of it. And so just filled it with a blood mix. So let's have a quick look at the bases up close. So this is the crushed glass option of snow. And this is the baking soda. As you can see, the bases I just went with were to really make it look like they're kind of running through a mountain range um, and just really to keep those dynamic options going. So there you go, they were a lot of fun to build and paint and I hope you guys look, enjoyed looking at them. See you all next time.